Hey folks and fans, it's your blind dyslexic. I came back. I stopped off at uh, grab a card for my stepmom and uh, come to find out one of the places that are in, at least one of the places that's in the farm shopping center. Did I get the, the, the farm shopping center? Happen to be open for business when the restaurant, so long as you keep your social distancing and you wish they had places roped off and uh, so long as you ask them for another cup for your, your refills. But anyway, Billy Sims, awesome. Person. But no, I'm leaving there and it suddenly dawned on me it must have been fate that I was supposed to go to Billy Sims. I'm waiting for the punchline. I know. <laughs> no, seriously, because I was debating whether or not I was going to go there or not. Because I wasn't certain if they were going to be open. And a lot of, and poor, poor Joe stuck up there in, uh, oh, New York City. We hit, we did two, we did like two casts last night. But uh, I digress. But no, I'm sit, I'm sitting there. And I'm about to leave, and there's a gentleman and his wife come in, and he starts, uh, I told him what happened to me over at Winco, and he started chatting with me and telling me how they're doing a little trip ever since the Georgia governor lifted the, the little lockdown. And he was taking trips and all that, and I told him how, uh, uh, I don't know if he was already doing but I said, grab to go menu from, uh, from all the local... Well, huh. so, yeah, that's a good idea. He says, I'll think about doing it. This is where the idea of fate came from. If I hadn't gone in there, I wouldn't have been able to tell him that, it, that information. Okay? This is what I'm talking about fate. A lot of times we're running late. A lot of times we... We are, uh, we forget something and we have to dive back. To me, that's fate's way of saying something is going to happen. And either something's good going to come to you or you're going to pass on some goodwill to someone else. This whole notion of, oh, they were slated to die type of fake garbage, I don't believe it. That, that's, that's stupid. That's just somebody trying to, to me, they're uneasy and they want to get out of the conversation so they throw the hole over. They were just slated to die. Garbage. But no. I want you to think about the next time you're running late. The next time you're you forget something. Uh, or it seems like you're trying to get somewhere and there's a car after car. Granted, we all gripe about that. Fate is stepping in stating you have to be somewhere at a certain time. You don't know when and what that is. But nonetheless, fate is telling you it's indicating to you that you will be rewarded in some way, shape, or form. That doesn't mean we're not going to complain about it when, it when it seems like everything's going wrong. Anyway, that was my quickie cast. That was my TBD on for eight of your life. I do other casts. I do a little walkabouts. I do, uh, like I said, I do cash with Joe, Matrix Lord 212, and I do a radio show on iVlog, and I occasionally do one on, uh, on TV Live, but nonetheless, I am your blind dyslexic. This has been TBD On. Ciao. For now.